you can provide safety, if you can provide, you will not work against the interests of the user and their societies, you will have a competitive service and you will have the moral standing, I think, to compete in the domain of policy to make this a standard, not just here at home, but for people who really need it, people who are truly vulnerable, journalists, activists, whistleblowers, uh, and people involved in civil resistance in deeply authoritarian areas. America's most wanted whistleblower, Edward Snowden, be a live link to the CBIT Global Conferences right here at CBIT 2015. It's nearly two years since the American investigative journalist and lawyer Glenn Greenwald first started publishing the classified NSA documents leaked to him by Edward Snowden. Back then, the revelations sent the IT world into a tailspin. And there's still more to come, with another large chunk of the documents due to be made available to selected journalists before the end of the year. Meanwhile, it's now the digital industry's declared objective to protect private data. I do think there's a genuine effort now on their part, not because they care about privacy, but because they care about their business, um, to demonstrate a genuine commitment to privacy. And, and there's a real conflict between governments and these companies now because these companies really are starting to embed their products with sophisticated encryption. Here at the CBIT, many companies are presenting new data privacy solutions. SecuSmart, for instance, has partnered with Vodafone Germany to develop an app that can be used to protect any mobile phone against digital eavesdropping. It costs only 15 euros a month and the user decides which calls to protect. SecuSmart is also partnering in the development of a secure Android tablet. Its contribution to the project is a secure micro SD card that has an NXP crypto controller that performs PKI user authentication. The tablet is is expected to be available for purchase by German government ministries by the end of this year. Voice communication is just as secure, but with the secure suite solution that we're developing for the government, the device itself is immune to intrusion by any spy agency in the world. It protects not just voice communication, but all data on the device. That's all emails, all attachments, all calendar entries, the whole device. In his address at CBIT, Edward Snowden called for greater engagement in in the interest of increased security and less surveillance. Edward, thank you very much. And can I just ask, um, when you are able to leave Russia, can, would you and Glenn please come and um, talk to us here in person on center stage at the CBIT Global Conferences? Can I get a <laughs> yes from you now? Sure. Let's, uh, let's ask Angela Merkel first if she'll uh, allow me interest. Well, <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thank you very much.